Hello guys, Logan here from Brothers at Work, and today we're going to be showing you how to install a flashing lights police skin, specifically for the uh, unmarked explorer, but this will work for any other police car. First, um, you're going to need a skin for your police car. So, we're going to go to Google Chrome, and then type flmods.com. Then up here, you want to go Mods in the top right, and then Vehicle Textures, and then Explorer. Then you just want to find anyone you want, and then you'll download it and drag it to your desktop. And then you should have it to your desktop. Next, you're going to need a program called uh, Asset Bundle Extractor. I'll leave a link down below for it to be uh, downloaded. So you're going to uh, click on that. Go to File, Open. You want to find your flashing lights directory. So for most of you, it's going to be Windows, Program Files x86. And then we're going to go down to Steam. Steam apps, common, flashing lights, and we go to flashing lights data, then scroll down until you see resources.assets, and then open that, and then it should open. Alright, um, never it's get opened. What you're going to do is just scroll down the whole way down until you see an unnamed asset and then you're just going to press H on your keyboard okay then you're going to need a vehicle code for the Explorer I'll leave all the police vehicle and fire and EMS codes in the description so you want to go search my name up and then just paste that code in for the Explorer which is right here and then make sure it's the texture file that's why we click the up button um, plugins then you want to edit, OK. Then you want to hit load. And then from here, you need to find where the skin you downloaded is at. So it's right here. Then you want to hit open, OK. This should pop up, hit OK. Then take a second or two to load, and hit OK. Would you like to save any changes? Yes. And then to save this to your desktop, then we do not need that no more. And we do not need that anymore. No All right, and then here is the file you need. Right, next step. So what you're gonna go is go back down to your file explorer, and then find your directory again. So it's Windows, Program Files, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, um, Flashing Lights, Flashing Lights Data, and then what you're gonna do is get this, drop, drag, drop, replace file. And uh, yeah, and then it should be in the game. Uh, I'll be posting more tutorials for the fire and EMS since it's different. And uh, make sure to comment other suggestions for the flashing lights game. So um, yeah, it's looking clear here. Like, subscribe. See you.